Welcome to Crafting with Louisa. Louisa here and today um got a really simple little Christmas card um using some of our um gold heat um embossing. Absolutely beautiful. Um I've done this one on cherry cobbler. The next one I'm doing it is on shaded spruce and it's using a stamp set that will be available through November um, and it's snow is glistening beautiful stamp set oh. and I've used a big tree there and sending a blizzard of wishes for a wonderful season and it's a beautiful stamp set it's got snowflakes on can't wait to start using that can't wait to start using some of the snowflakes for some backgrounds as well so that's what we're going to use today Today, um, so um, and I'll leave a link f um, as usual. All the um, I'm using my stamp position. Um, all the dimensions will be on the blog post. Um, yes. So I've got my stamping layer, which is shaded spruce. Um, and I did think this would be gorgeous in Merry Mellow. Oh, so I've got um, gold embossing powder and the little um, embossing buddy thing. I can't remember what we call I really ought to check what that's called in the catalogue. And I forgot to do this on the... Um, on the other one and <laughs> because I've lost the foam bit really I'm just using one of the um embossing layers for the stamp uh, for the big shot um because I've no idea where the foam is I need to go and get some fun foam obviously and cut a layer and just position that make sure that where we want it. Um, so Versafine, not Versafine, Versamark. And I always think heat embossing is a little bit like magic because it goes on really dull. Um, and then when you heat emboss it, it goes really shiny. And you're just thinking, oh, and you probably won't be able to see this. We might just about actually. It's on the white that you can't. Okay. So I'm happy with that. I think some of that is just some of the powder. Right there. Okay. I'm happy with that. Let's take that out. Stick that over there. Um, I'm just going to fold that up so I've got something to dump my powder on. So I'm using our gold embossing powder, which is gorgeous stuff. I don't have a lot of embossing powder. I ought to do more, really. If you do get any where you don't want it, just get a little paintbrush and you can flick it off. I seem to be okay, so I'm going to dump that back in the pot. Okay, and then I inevitably get embossing powder over there. <laughs> so heat gun. And I'm gonna heat this up. I'm just gonna heat it up on my hand just so it's a bit hot. And if I bring that close and you'll be able to see hopefully. And it will 
just go and it just looks amazing. And this is a really good detailed embossing powder. Love it. And I think it just makes a really elegant card. And the, the stamp is um, the tree's made out of little snowflakes. So that's embossed really nicely. So I'm pleased with that. So I'm going to grab, <laughs> I found another snail, because in my last video I ran out of snail and I had to use my Tombow, the one in the red thing, and then I realised that um, <laughs> that had run out and then I found that and then I ordered, it was weeks ago, I ordered some refills of the Tombow because for the snail and the Tombow I always order kind of three or four refills because I use them so quickly and then I realised I never looked in the packet I realised that I brought what I thought were five refills or four refills or whatever they were and then I realised that they weren't refills they were the the whole thing so I've got about five complete um Tombo extreme adhesive things, but never mind. Rather than refills. <laughs> oh, hey ho, hey. but it's too late to send them back because they've been sat in the package for about three weeks. So, yes. So we'll see. I ordered some. <laughs> I had to put an order in because I'd run out of snail adhesive, and then I realised I'd got about one sheet of Whisper White, and I use Whisper White quite a lot for things. Um, so I had to put an order in for that, so we'll see if I've managed to order the refills or the whole things. <laughs> anyway, so those are the two cards. I think you'll agree, absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Um in cherry cobbler and shaded spruce, I think that would look fabulous in Merry Mellow. Um so give it a try and give it a try with you haven't just got gold embossing powder, so try it with all the other ones that look fabulous in silver uh, so thank you very much for um, watching and it's using the stamp set that will only be available in November I'll leave all the links on the blog post for, um, for the details for that and thank you for watching and I'll see you next time bye <laughs>